check the map, Tyler. You know where we're going? Five times today and we'll pass the pass the medicine ball at the top. Alright. Cool. Over the last four or five months, I've been training Nate Davis and my son Tyler Monaco. And we've tried to come out to Crowder's about every three or four weeks. And we're only about a week and a half out from the start of the climb. We're getting the last big push in here and doing the stairs. Uh, so it's a pretty good pre-training run. Uh, also to really test our gear one last time before we head to Africa. Try to stretch that out, it's tight, okay? The purpose of going to Africa is to support Trek for TEF. It's to raise awareness and, and charitable support for the Elijah Foundation, which supports uh, families around the world by giving them the educational tools and support to make sure that children with special needs are not placed in homes that have the support from their families and the communities so that they can live a normal life. All right, Nate, take your time. Tony said we're gonna be hiking like six to eight hours a day, and it's gonna be about like an eight day trip. So it's gonna be some pretty hardcore trekking. Good job, setting a good pace. The goal that we have, um, you know, ultimately we'd all like to make to the top of Kilimanjaro, but I think what we're gonna find along the way and what I know have, having worked with Eli and the Elijah Foundation previously is that it's the things that you learn during the journey along the way okay. to Kilimanjaro that are gonna be long lasting memories and life lessons. I feel like I'm ready for it. Um, yeah, I feel like I am. I'm nervous too at the same time. This is new to me, going half around the world and going to Africa. We're trying to provide uh, Nate an opportunity to do some things on his own, be away from his parents, and I think along the way uh, he'll gain confidence, he'll gain some independence. I think this is going to just uh, uh, show him and then show everyone around him that you, know, you can do what you set your mind to.